All right, guys, I'm about to do my grocery haul, but I'm pulling out the meat and this chicken is leaking and I don't want to put my other groceries on the table um, with obviously nasty chicken stuff up here. So I'm going to go ahead and just show you the meat and then I'll show you everything else. I got one pound of pork sausage for breakfast for dinner. I got two packs of the boneless chicken breasts. Um, I cut these in half because they're very thick and then two of these can feed all four of us. Um, I've got two things of our favorite boneless pork rib things that we always get. Two things of turkey bacon here and then one whole chicken for roasted chicken and then whatever's left over I throw in soup. I got two things of strawberries. Um, I did get some garden salad to go along with some dinner meals that we're having and maybe some lunch if I'm in the mood for a salad for lunch. Um, I got two cartons of Roma tomatoes. I had a lettuce for BLTs that we will be having. Oranges were on sale and then baby carrots were 49 cents so I got two bags of those. Um, turkey pepperoni for the Italian pasta salad we're gonna be having. Sour cream, my phone is going off. Uh, cottage cheese, I got four containers. Um, my favorite Fuji apples, they were cheaper than the other apples, so we grabbed those. Only one loaf of bread this time because I don't have a lot of sandwiches on the meal plan for lunches. Uh, we're kind of tired of sandwiches, so I've got to switch that up a bit. Tortilla rounds for nacho night. I did get Brussels sprouts. We all love our Brussels sprouts, so I usually do a bag of carrots and a bag of Brussels sprouts with some sort of grilled chicken. Um, a giant cucumber, half for salad, and then half for the pasta salad I'll be making. And the same thing for the peppers. Um, some of it's going to go in pasta salad and a few other meals. Um, jumbo biscuits for breakfast for dinner. Crescent rolls for another meal. Uh, mild cheddar cheese for my son's eggs because he cannot eat eggs without it. I got a couple blocks of this Colby Jack for snacking and for some pasta salad again. A um, couple bags of vegetables. I've got two mixed vegetables, one sweet corn, one sweet peas, and two broccoli. I did get four things of eggs, um, Texas toast, five cheese, and then I went ahead and grabbed these uh, chicken breast patties because I like to eat them with just a side of vegetables for lunch one day or I will cook one up and throw it in my salad. Two gallons of 2% milk. So I got berry and then cranberry. My taco seasoning burst open, which unfortunately when one of the cashiers does it, she has a tendency of busting open my seasonings. And a lot of the times I will go back in and let them know and they'll get me a fresh one. But I didn't have time today. So thankfully I bought Ziploc bags and I was able to put one in a Ziploc baggie. <sighs> so yeah, she's, she's a talkative one. But anyway, trail mix, two boxes. Um, that's mostly for my husband to take to work for a snack. Uh, two things of chicken broth for some soup I'm going to make. Uh, cream of chicken for one night. I did grab four cans of the peach slices in extra light syrup. Uh, two things of large pitted olives, one for a pasta and one for nacho night. I got uh, pasta sauce, traditional, for spaghetti. I wasn't sure if I needed a spaghetti noodles, so I went ahead and grabbed them. I, I'm pretty sure I do. And then, of course, our usual whole grain, uh, chewy dip chocolate chip, Granola bars for on the run or after school if the kids are craving something sweet. I did grab three more boxes of cereal. I get a thing of sugar for my coffee, tea, Walmart. I've got 10 Gatorades. These were 88 cents, which is the price of a Powerade. So I got him the actual Gatorade brand. Variety of flavors there. <laughs> and then I got this cubed ham. I'm gonna put half in a pasta. And then half I'm going to freeze for soup and in the future. I feel like I'm stuttering a lot today, guys. I'm trying to hurry because i got to leave to get my kids here soon. Then we're going to have stir fry. And I wanted to try this General Sal's stir fry sauce. It sounded good to me. So I'm hoping that it's going to taste good. It's a new one that they're carrying here. Um, so we'll see. I got Aaron four cans of soup, two of the chicken corn chowder, and then two of the pub style chicken pot pie so he can start taking maybe some soup for lunch, um, soups and salads. That's kind of the plan for lunch these next few weeks. 
Um, and then I wanted to try this new brand. It was the same price as what I usually go for um, for my Progresso. But it's Campbell's Well Yes. And I got every flavor that they have. So they have minestrone with kale soup. They had sweet potato corn chowder. Black bean with red quinoa soup. Um, Italian vegetable with farro soup. Roasted chicken with wild rice. And then we got hearty lentil with the vegetables. And then I went ahead and grabbed two cans of the chicken noodle soup. I like chicken noodle soup, so I felt like this would be a safe one. Um, and I'm pretty sure I'll like the wild rice one too. But I wanted to give the other ones a try. And that's going to be my lunch over the next few days. I also grabbed some apple cinnamon rice cakes. I like to put peanut butter on these for like a quick snack. Uh, Aaron's shakes for the morning. He doesn't like to eat in the morning, so this is kind of my solution to make sure he's at least getting something. Um, <laughs> wax, because maintenance. Um, and then I needed quart size freezer bag 